Yo, what's up everybody? This is Papa Bale, and uh, we're looking at the pulse motor, and yeah, um, this is as far as we're getting with this idea, because and through the coils that are supposedly have no juice running through them, I guess every time this light pulses, juice flows through the coils. I do have this switch in the off position, so I don't see why that was happening. It is like flashing more often, so it wants to come on, or maybe it doesn't want to come on, and that, that's why it's doing what it's doing. Uh, but this will not spin faster than it's spinning and that's like 120 volts so I don't understand this uh, maybe there's a way to balance that uh, truth be told I've gotten the farthest with my kinetic energy my turbine generator just throw it on the bottom generate some DC electricity granted it, it has a lot more friction involved with it but yeah I got the farthest with that because this this is I can't think of anything else other than to make the stronger coils which I'm gonna do Yeah, so we'll do that. We'll make some coils. We'll hook the generator back up. And uh, we'll go from there. But uh, the power supply, I don't understand why it's draining from the kinetic. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's just enough charge going through those coils to magnetize them. And it's not hooked to a reed switch, so yeah, I can see how that would be it. So how how do we change that rectifier, right? We got to put a rectifier in there to make sure the energy, the electricity is all flowing in one direction. True. Just where where do I put it? There's the 10 ohm resistor that I was messing around with earlier today. But this is ridiculous, man. This is like nothing. We need way more motion in this. Uh, now we don't need to make DC as much as we need to prevent the energy from coming out into the coils so I, I don't know I don't know we really gotta prevent that maybe I could talk to my friend he seemed to know a little bit about the energy going back into the power supply And they're probably being forced out into the coils through um, the power node in the in the hookup. So it's not hooked up to like the DC part. It's hooked up to the AC um, in. It's hooked up to the in. Yeah, I'm, I'm all right. It's okay. It was an idea based on a suggestion that, you know, maybe if you have a power supply on the other end, that, you know, maybe it'll work. But I'm, what I'm thinking is, if I can get eight volts out of the generator, 
That should be enough to make something happen. All right. Thank you very much. Peace out. Have a good night.